This is a new feature being released for the HQ Pro Stitcher in June of 2013. I'm going to bring in a design. I want to try use the block 16 and in my area I can now skew to more than four points. So if I were using on a quilt a snowball block or an octagon block, uh, it has eight points. And you can see right here where it will start counting as I create that eight point block. I'm going to turn on my grid and actually create an octagon. Press multi-point. Move up to the next multi-point. So I've got two, as you can see, in the counter. Three. And with the skew in the area, I need to make sure that these designs, or the area is uh, an actual um, convex, which means that there are no inside corners. So it skews to outside corners. I now have eight. I'll turn off my grid. I now have eight. Now this is perfect. This is a perfect corner, but if I went, if I, um, let's undo one of these and let's actually move this so that it's a little uh, skewed. Maybe a piecer is not very good and so her, out, her um, octagon looks a little skewed there. I want to take this design and skew it in there. So I'm going to my skew and align, press the skew, and there it is. Now, I might not like the way this is positioned, so I can go to my rotation. With a small rotation, I can maybe turn this around and make it look more pleasing to the eye so it doesn't look that, like the design is maybe skewed as bad so that it helps the quilter look better. So, you know, but right now that looks pretty good. But I can turn that around and make that look better. Now, what if that's not the design I want to use? Let's choose another design. Let's close this design out. We don't want to save it. Let's open up another design. Let's choose this block 17. Now let's go to skew and skew it in there. Now that's not very pretty. And that's sometimes what the skew can do, but when you take your rotation and start rotating that design, oops, let's rotate it the right way, either way so that, then it becomes that design that you saw in the file and it will look better. It will skew to the block and fit all of the edges as it goes around, but using your rotation, you'll be able to make that more look more pleasing to the eye. Now, let's choose another design. Close that design. Let's open up and let's take the feather wreath. Skew it. Let's refresh it so we can see. Now, see how nice that looks? The, de the piecer was not very good at piecing, but by choosing the correct design, you can make the design look nice in the block. Now, I can go ahead and still rotate, but it's not going to really make any difference because this is quite circular and it is filling the area perfect. Now this is an awesome feature, along with the counter, so you can see how many points you've put into your area, and also that we can skew to as many multi-points as we want. You can actually put as many in there and make that a complete circle. So enjoy using this feature.